What's up, folks? What's going on? I finally got my school done. I still got a little bit of scraping to do up, up at the top of the antlers. But... Here he is. I kept the antlers natural. Which was a big pain in that butt. I had to put a little bit of stain on it where on the back the bleach got to the back of it. But I had two rolls of electrical tape. He's got that little thing up there at the top. And if you can see that antler right there, I don't know how well you can see it. It's got a funny shape to it. These are the ones that I found last year. That's his aunt, his. This is two years ago. You can see the little bend right there. And it's kind of bladed. See that? can't see it very good because he's up there but see the blade that's him I found his matching sheds two years ago and then this one I'm pretty sure is him I have this I have him on video when he had these and the other side I didn't find but the other side brow time just like that and there's that funky blade it's on a different antler right beside it but I'm pretty sure that's him I have him on video, and then I have, which is the same one, I have him on video last year before I shot him, but that's pretty cool, I got, I'm pretty sure that's from him, and I know that's from him, so, it's undeniable with that one beam there. But I've worked hard on this one. This is my uh, biggest deer to date. There's one bigger around here that I was after last year. He was bigger than this one. A lot more mass. This one's got some good mass to him. But that one last year is huge. He almost came down the same trail. He was coming down the same trail as this one was coming down. But a doe took him off into the woods. Uh, three does led this guy right down to me. I'm hoping to get that other big one this year. So stay tuned. And I got trapping coming up after that. But there you go, folks. It is finally done. I'm going to do some scraping up underneath the antlers up there. Where I had tape, and I'll have to scrape it and bleach it a little bit right there. But I'm pretty satisfied. I'm not happy with the bleach getting on the back. I don't know how you keep the bleach off the antlers. I had electrical tape on there. Two rows of it. Past the antlers onto the skull, and they were tight. And I still... Got bleach up the back of them somehow. It went up the back. I think it when I was laying down in the water. You know, they're very hard to get down in the bleach water. They just don't lay right. <laughs> but 
If you're not subscribing, hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell. You can get updates on my videos. Leave me a comment and tell me what you think. I appreciate it. Thanks, folks. Later.